gonna do the same sequence for Superfly. We're gonna start back to back. I'm gonna allow the swing to slide down. So it's, we're gonna start from the floor, okay? I'm gonna let, allow the swing to slide down to my hips. I use my forearms to press it down. I'm gonna lean back into it. Hold on to the swing. Kick your legs wide and wrap around. Yeah, so now we can face each other. Now this is the same thing. You have to get the swing in the sweet spot, sweet spot before you kick. Right? If it's too high, you just come back. So in this position, yep, just get it nice and up with your forearms. That's it. Yeah. Thanks, guys. So I'm going to reach up and I'm going to grab the right leg into my hands. Okay, and repetition. We just do it over and over again. So we could do all of our core strengthening from here that we did before. So we're going to go right into our happy Buddha. So leg loops are going to be on the elbow creases. Press the hips forward. Yay! Really nice, guys. Never get cold. <laughs> <laughs> so I open up the arms. Go ahead and arch. And open up the chest. Let this feel good, right? So every pose we pause and we take in the yummy goodness of that length and space through the neck and shoulders. This, this in itself will heal a lot of shoulder injury. Okay, so this is a big transition. So we're going to come into skydiving through backpack. So we have to straighten our legs towards the earth, squeeze the leg loops up onto the shoulders, get them into that little spot on the inside of the shoulders. There's a little nape there that you can hang out in. So we extend the arms out to a T. Then bend the knees. Okay. And we can bend from side to side. Beautiful. Nice. Really good, guys. This is amazing. <laughs> okay. So extend the legs. So we're going to tuck. We have to tuck in so our thumbs can reach underneath. Okay. We have to push. So there's a little bit of oomph to push and extend the arms. Really good, guys. So in, when we're in super fly, we're going to go ahead and bend from side to side, push one hand down, and then the other hand down, and we have a lot of play. Whee! <laughs> nice. So come on down through chaturangas. Let's do five chaturangas. And you will feel the squeeze on your inner thighs. And then we're going to try toe touches. Okay, so extend your arms out, and then just pull the energy towards center. Extend out. <laughs> Pull towards center. It's really hard. <laughs> nice. And then we're going to place these back onto the shoulders. Come back through skydiver. Nice, guys. That nice so easy. Now, this is where we're going to change that. We're not going to come out yet. We take our feet. We're going to hook, tuck, and press straight up towards the sky. Yeah! Yeah, that's cool. the thing. Right? I understand. Yeah. So push your hips towards me a little bit more. Yeah, straight up and down, and hands towards the ground. Hands towards the ground, the shoulder stand. There you go. So there's another pose. It's called Christ Consciousness, this is where we go from here. Now we can open our arms to a T. We're going to arch like we did where we, our chest comes towards the earth, and we look back slightly, and that's beautiful. So Christ Consciousness, one of my favorite poses. Mm -hmm. So beautiful. Shoulder stand and Christ consciousness. We simply bend the knees. We wind up in skydiver. Bend the knees feet together. Really good. And then from skydiver, we start to bend the elbows. Just let the leg loops slide up. We come back to the archer. Mm -hmm. From archer, we go ahead. We can slide into the hands. We can bring the leg loops on the inside and come on out. We'll just get happy good of it. We've, we've done it. Are down, take a break. Woo! Nice. Really nice. Okay, I'm going to show you guys how we can get right into. We're going to turn around now. Stand up. We usually don't let people pop right out of the swing. I'm you know, just having you turn around. You can stay seated in the swing if you need to recalibrate. So there's a way to go right into super fly. Remember when I was showing you what we were doing, the arm strengthening, why this was so important? Mm -hmm. In the beginning, because we wanted to get the underbelly strong enough to lift us up when we were in some of the flips. And I showed you Superfly back then. Okay, so 
what we're going to do is put the swing, let's watch for the first one, we put the swing across our hips, below the waist, right? So if my hands are on my lower abdomen, I know I have it in the right place. Okay, I lean back, I hold on to my leg loops, and this is just for the flying monkeys, the advanced folks. Are these the same? So forgive me a little, okay. Don't they look uneven? They're not even at all. Okay. Yeah, I'm familiar. So I'm going to push my feet into the swing. And so from here, I arch and open and I come up. Okay? So it does take a little bit of a bump. The key is to use the feet. Okay? So my toes are in, my heels are out. I have the arch and open. And then chaturanga, then press up. Okay? So, and then when we come down, we can just let our feet thread through that little space and come to stand. Is the swing across the sweet spot or not, or up? It is. It is in the sweet spot. Okay. Always. <laughs> Let's try it. Okay? Now, remember, this is advanced, so take your time learning it. And I'm here to spot you, so if you don't get it on the first try, it's okay. It's, you have to, like, figure out the arching and the opening and turning the arms over and all that jazz. But we slide down. Get the swing nice and low. Lean back into it. See, I walk my feet forward. Okay, so we keep it, keep the swing in the sweet spot just by leaning back. Okay, and hold on to my legs and to my hands, not a wrist strap, just in my hands. My knees come wide. My toes are in, my heels are out. Swing the legs are on the outside of the knees. I arch by pushing into my feet. Legs are on the outside. Extend the arms, extend the legs. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Oh yeah. Hello, hips. <laughs> and then we can do all the same poses from there. Chaturangas. Just go ahead and try to doing the toe touches, which are crazy hard, right? Toe touches. Squeeze the energy towards the center line. You can create Andy. You know you're a superstar to yourself. So you're like, oh yeah, I got this. Okay. Put the leg loops on the shoulders. Come back from our skydiver, bend the knees. Nice, guys. Skydiver, right? Mm -hmm. Up from here, hook the feet, tuck, press the legs straight up and down. Hands towards the earth. Shoulders stand. So we're straight up and down. So tuck in to your shoulders, straight up and down. Pull your navel in. Like that? Yeah. You call this shoulder stand, not handstand? I do call it shoulder stand because the legs are on the shoulders. Okay, yeah. And then we're going to open. Now we arch and bring our hands to a T for Christ consciousness. Now we expand through the belly. So the first one we stay stacked. The next one we open up. This is a big stretch everywhere. Beautiful, okay. Now all we do is simply bend the knees and bring the feet together. They arch. Yeah, all of a sudden we're in the sky. Beautiful. And now we bend the elbows. We wind up an archer. Mm -hmm. Let's go ahead and tuck and come through our happy Buddha. Maybe from the inside, straighten the arms. <sighs> Wide straddle. And kick through center. And the scissor down. Yeah, exactly. Got it. Good balance, good control. Does that feel nice? Yeah. Yeah. Really good. That hip drop and side over is so soothing for my hips. Mm. And I was doing it last night. It just so good. <laughs> yeah. It really feels good to get the squeeze as long as you come out when the body's like, okay, that's enough. <laughs> So let's try popping up into our super fly and coming back out, which means we thread our legs through this spot. Okay? So we're just going to come back, go up into the super fly and come back out. Okay? So swing well. <laughs> swing low. Thank you. <laughs> Hold on. Bend the knees, push into the feet. Come on up. Yeah, I don't think the knees push into the feet or you don't make it. Oh, um, so we can Push your feet into the swing. <laughs> <laughs> See how easy it is to get 
So will you come down this way for us, Annie? We're gonna come and help you. Okay, so you bend into Chaturanga, go ahead and bring your head towards the ground and let your feet come out. So <laughs> go ahead. Bend into Chaturanga now, straighten the arms towards the sky. Keep coming down, straighten the arms towards the sky. Go towards the Oh, fast. And then let your legs go through. Ah, oh, yeah. You can trust me. <laughs> I totally like, trust you. Yeah, I'll just stuff my mind. Like, yeah, uh-uh, I know. Yeah, so okay. chaturanga, then straighten your arms. Okay. Yeah, you said. No problem. It's okay. So it helps to give step-by-step when we're learning something new, and I was just testing you and see if I can just tell you to pop up into it. Okay, let's do it again. Yeah, so hold on to the leg loops, lean back. Now, you, you're not underneath your thumb lines. You're going to have a big swing forward. Yeah. So go ahead and kick your legs up and around. Keep the knees bent. Relax. Relax. I'm going to be able to move you. Relax. So bend the knees. Push the feet. Oh, right. Okay. Into the swing. So the toes are in. That heels are out. And then Arch and open. Yes. Beautiful. And extend the legs. Okay. Okay. Extend the legs and the arms. Because if you keep your feet tight, it comes very hard. Now you're going to just come through the chaturanga, mm -hmm. chaturanga, and then straighten the arms. Okay, you can do that too. So keep your leg loops in your hands. Mm -hmm. You didn't have to let go of this. Then let the feet come through this spot. Let it thread right through. Right. So move it. Let's try it again. Okay, so we're going to come up through superfly and then come right back down. You want me to show you one more time? Okay, so just watch for this one. Okay, take the breath. And this is just really for fun. It's not like any particular therapeutic besides for the joy. So I'm here, bend, and thread through. I still scissor down, so otherwise you're going to rip blood Okay, let's try it again. So if you press back, you're going to have a big swing. So if you walk to the front, okay, right underneath your thumb line. Okay. Go ahead and lean back. Pick up. Arch and open. Extend the arms and legs. Good job. Good job. Extend the legs. Yep. It's hard if you're going to extend the legs. Okay. Chaturanga. Straighten the arms. Hit the feet through that little spot. Yeah! There you go. That's it. You got it. Isn't that fun? Yeah. You're like, woo -hoo, woo -hoo. Really good, guys. All right. So, why don't we go ahead, just because this is a harder sequence, why don't we, one at a time, just talk you through it, you get to do it, and then I can watch you and you can ask questions, that kind of thing. Okay, so we're going to start out in our floating Buddha. Well, we're all going to watch, we're just going to do it one at a time, is that okay? Everybody gets a break out of it, too. Yeah, so there sure we go. Yeah. Okay, so floating Buddha. And hang out there. Now go ahead and just come through the namaste and the ladle to bring yourself upside down. So hold on to the swing for the ladle and then wrap your legs around. Mm -hmm. Great. So this is called Peaceful Warrior. Everyone say Peaceful Warrior. Peaceful, peaceful warrior. warrior. This is good. To, so clasp the elbows and hang. That's the whole Peaceful Warrior. Really good. Now from there, we want to come into Happy Buddha. Everybody say Happy Buddha. Buddha. Let's get the leg loops in your hands. Mm -hmm. Take them off the feet and turn up straight. Mm -hmm. So hands in front. Hands in front. Okay, yep. Very good. Now from the <laughs> yep. we come into Archer. And we say Archer. 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 So you open up the legs, open up the arms. Yep. The leg loops on the other side. Not yet. Not yet. No. Like Archer. Archer. So every pose, even though it's a transition, every pose is important because what's the, what this is doing is opening up the shoulders. So we have to open up the shoulders before we can get into the next pose. So then the next pose is sky diver. Sky diver. Squeeze the legs together. I'm sorry, squeeze the arms together, let the legs extend. Mm -hmm. And then you can open up the arms wide as well. Yay! Then you can bend the knees again. Together. Beautiful thing, a little bit from side to side, which is super fun to play in skydiver. Okay, great. So now we have to come to backpack. So say backpack, everyone just repeat after me. Backpack. 
Thank you. Okay, you have to tuck the belly in to get the thumb hook. And then you have to extend the arm. So it's a chaturanga, legs extend at the same time, towards the floor, yeah, arms out. So kind of together, yeah. Because this is like the ring thing, which is very, very hard. Then you have come through five chaturangas. Let's just pretend one, two, three, four, five. One. <laughs> Toe touches. Go ahead and squeeze the hands together. Too. Yes. Extend. Super fly. You're awesome. Oh, okay. Wow. Okay, great. Go ahead and put the leg loops back on the shoulders. We come back through Skydiver. Really good. Extend. Beautiful. Now from here, we're ready for our shoulder stand. Mm -hmm. So we go up. Everybody repeat. Shoulder stand. Shoulder stand. <laughs> hands down to down, down, down. Now, what she did, a lot of people do. And what you do, if you raise your hands towards the sky, is lose your anchors. And you're not going to go too far, but you don't ever want to slide out. So I always tell people hands towards the ground. Very important detail. For whatever reason, people just look towards the sky, and I'm like, oh my god. <laughs> Beautiful. From there, so right now, she lost the pose. So when we stack, we're going to go straight up and down, right? So we went this to tuck into. Yes, there it is. There it is. That shoulder stand. Okay? Yes, yes. Otherwise, then what's the point of doing this? Christ consciousness, we're already there. So then we open up the arms to a T, and now we can arch and move back. Beautiful. Such a lovely what one. Nice arch. Isn't that amazing? Yeah. Cool. So all we need to do now to transition back into skydiver. Mm -hmm. Skydiver. Say it. Skydiver. Bend the knees. Great. And then from skydiver, where do we go? We can flip out. No. From uh, skydiver, we're we go. We're following the same sequence. Look at your outline if you don't know. Right? We're, we're, we're learning through visual, through audio, through kinesthetic, through written. So archer, right? Bend the elbows and slide in. We're just reversing now. Mm -hmm. Beautiful. And then there, from there, now we can come out by straightening the arms. Um, you can come to Happy Buddha too. Go ahead and do Happy Buddha. Well, yeah. Leg loops in front. Yes. Nice leg loops in front or behind is going to be really important because a lot of people get stuck. Now you can straighten the arms. Really good job. Straighten the arms and then scissor kick out. Beautiful. Straighten your body in a great season. Yeah. Always do one spot or you can sit like this. Really good job. Does that feel good? Get in there. Yeah. You'll you definitely get it. Just repetition. Very nice. So, um, would you like to do the next thing? Um, I'd like to watch them. Okay. And well, you guys have already okay. done it, so you're it. Um. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> so, we're going to start out in floating Buddha. So, take yourself into floating Buddha. You guys are just going to repeat the names again, just so we can get <laughs> so we can get the memorization of what it looks like with the name. And, yeah. So from floating Buddha, we're going to come through Namaste. Namaste. Thank you. Namaste. <laughs> to ladle. Ladle. Beautiful. Well, from ladle, keep your hands holding on for this version. Okay. You can wrap your legs wide and around, and come through. Bend your knees. Wide and around, knees stay wide the whole time. Oh, my. Feet together, knees wide. Like that. Bend your knees, feet together. Bend my knees. Oh, bend my knees. Peaceful warrior, guys. Peaceful right. warrior. Peaceful warrior. Peaceful warrior. Clasp right. the elbows. Clasp the elbows together. With the, um, slow it down. Okay. Oh, like this. Yeah. So notice when the brain starts working and when the body stops being intelligent, right? So we want to make sure that we get our body and our brain and everybody with us. So we're going to just slow it down if we ever start to get excited or confused. And I'm totally going to guide your hands, so don't worry about okay. it. Just take a breath. So step by step. So now we're going to reach up and grab the leg loops. Mm -hmm. okay. So go ahead and get the feet out. So get the feet off and then return the feet. Really good. So hold on. Slow down. I'm gonna slow it down because I'm getting really excited. <laughs> nice. So let your let the leg loops land on the elbow creases. Right. And now we're in happy Buddha. Happy Buddha. Happy Buddha. Happy Buddha. Yeah, nice good. Arch and open. Arch and open. Arch and open. So get the leg loops on the outside. Open up the arms. Yeah. Arch and open. Like. Is that Archer. Mm -hmm. Archer. 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 
So now we're going to come to the skydiver. Skydiver. Got to squeeze the arms together. Yeah. Extend the legs. Arch it over. Nope, nope. Wait, come back. Come back. Don't have to put my arms down in the lift. In your hands. Yeah. So extend your legs. Hold up. Just leave everything where it is. Go back to Archer. Okay. So we're in class, right? Okay. Somebody's getting nervous. Somebody's getting super so hyper. No, no, we'll just, no. Just, let's, let's, are you okay staying here? Because I'm slowly yes, down so you can arch and open. Come back to Archer. Archer. Arch and open. Yeah, there you go. Now keep your upper body as it is. Extend your legs towards the ground, not towards the sky, and then squeeze your arms together towards the ground again. Leg loops go into the shoulder then. Straight arms. Yeah, good. Now you're nice and strong, so you can muscle through that, but most people will have trouble if they don't squeeze their arms towards the ground. Okay, so you straight way. arms, straight arms, nobody gets the other side. And that's perfect. And so um, from here, now you're going to come into skydiver, right? So what does skydiver look like? Standing over the knees. Yeah, and then bend the knees. Knees are wide, feet together. So if she keeps bringing her feet back, she's going to lose her anchor. So your feet are together. Either way. So you tell us it's okay. okay. Skydiver. Skydiver. Oh, okay. So feet are together. Right? So we want the muscle memory to match the name of the pose. That's why we're starting right now. Okay. So now we're going to come into backpack. So you're going to grab for the leg loops underneath. Yeah. And extend the legs. Extend the arms. Good. That's super fly. Nice. Okay. So you're really good at super fly. You must have been doing it with Nadia. This, yes. Yeah. So I was like, Which not really hard to do, but I don't know if you shouldn't do that. So. I know. I, I did train her, so yeah. that's how she knows one of the Yeah. So super fly coming to Chuck Rungus. Push ups. Nice. Yeah, most people don't get super fly on the first try, anyway, so you're doing great. So just getting the knees and the movements down. And then go ahead and try some toe touches. Straight arms, toe touches. Looks good. Toe touches. Yeah, so squeeze the hands together right out in front of you so you, you have nice mm -hmm. long lines of energy. Yeah, there you go. Good. Now you're going to return those back onto the shoulders. Oh, relax and skydiver. So remember, skydivers with the knees bent, the feet together. So you have to keep the knees wide to get the feet together, mm -hmm. right? Like right. a lot. Mm -hmm. Really good. So now what you're going to do is come into a shoulder stand. Shoulder stand. Shoulder stand. Shoulder so stand. Hands are always squeezing down towards the ground. Notice that each person did the same thing where they almost lost their anchor. We are wrapped here, so nobody's going to go anywhere. But in some poses, that's our only anchor. And it's really, really important to squeeze your hands down towards the ground first and then extend the legs. Oh, first hand. So to make sure we have the angle, it's just beautiful. And that's straight up and down, that looks really good. So in these poses, I also just pay attention to people's hips, right? So she has something going on with this hip that's creating a line coming over to the side. Yeah. Okay? So the swing is the truth serum that tells me about the alignment in the body. And so mm -hmm. if I was working with her, I would just start to help find the alignment and shift that in her body. I'm not doing it for her, I'm encouraging that new alignment. Right. Okay, great. So price consciousness. Extend the arms to a T, arch it open. Beautiful. Such a, love. Such a lovely pose. <laughs> so all we're gonna do now is we're gonna keep the same shape. We're just gonna bend the knees and bring the feet back together. Bend the knees, let them come out nice and slow, feet together. Skydiver. Okay, I also just like to notice when people's hands are doing the same thing. Cool. So from here, we're going to come back into Archer. Just bend the elbows, let them slide in. Okay, Archer. Now, if the elbows are bent and it's going to hook, it's okay for them to help the leg loop off the shoulder, right? Otherwise, I'd be nervous about them moving their arm up like that. Mm -hmm. Leg loops go on the inside for Happy Buddha. Very good. Yay. Yay. <laughs> so exciting. Straighten the arms, hold on to the leg lifts in the hands, and then go ahead and scissor out. So bring the legs together, balance, and then come on out. Beautiful. Really nice. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> so stay seated and come into the sumo 
much fun after doing something so amazing. You know, and we all want to pop out like we're gymnasts or something and do this and that. <laughs> but we're going to stay in that. That was really good. And thank you for your patience and slowing it down and really getting it so that, you know, if we start like bringing our legs towards the sky when they're supposed to be down towards the earth, we will slide out of the swing. So those are the things that, if it seems critical, I'll slow it down. If it's like, oh, she's just figuring no, it out. Yeah. It's really good. And if you just do it 100 times, or 100,000 times, you know, a gazillion times, it works. Good job, guys. I'm so confident that you guys know how to do this. I'm so we're going to move along. Any questions about that? Yeah. <laughs> that is your Shakti flow oh, happening. Yeah. There is no lack of energy in our body. We are just freeing it up. Freeing it up, right? Yeah, I mean, that's the exhilaration, is energy flowing in the body again. Really fun. And joy really makes a big difference. So that's why I appreciate your patience, because sometimes when we're learning something new and we get nervous, we lose our joy, right? We want to make it joyfully whenever we get into the toe of slides. I find if I slow it down with the person, it sometimes works and sometimes doesn't. I think I'm a big mess up. I know how. Oh, totally. <laughs> and I really try to bring just more and easy grace into it, if possible. Yeah. We are ready to go on to the forward folds. You guys ready? All right, more practice. We have an hour. We are going to, um, we'll have, we'll, we'll start having up at 625. Okay, mm -hmm. take the swings down, start to, to um, clear everything out. That would be a good time. Put that over here. Try this angle again. Ah, we're going to be reviewing until we read about the sequence. We're not going to be doing the acrobatics. <clears throat> I created this new flow. The Hawaiian retreat since we stretched it out to um, six days. <laughs> so I do the training in a three day period or a six day period, and when it's six days, it's, it's quite special. Um, I don't know how many more retreats I'll be doing because it is twice as much work for me for half the money. <laughs> but I do like the environment of it, you know what I mean? Because it's just super We're sweet. In Hawaii. Uh, well, at this particular place, it's in Maui, um, it's in Haiku. Uh, I'm probably just going to take in for two of the sleep. I'm drinking so much fluid. Uh, give me one minute. 